Hi everyone, welcome back to the Ocean Worldwide Real Estate Podcast. I'm Alice. And I'm Daniel. Today, we're diving into a topic that's really important for anyone looking to invest in real estate. Understanding rental yields in Thailand. That's right, Daniel. Thailand's property market is booming. And with rental yields ranging from 5% to 10%, it's no wonder investors are flocking here. Whether you're interested in condos, villas, or even undeveloped land, there's a lot to cover today. Absolutely. So let's break it down for our listeners, starting with what rental yield actually means and why it's so crucial for investors. Alice, can you kick us off with a quick definition of rental yield for those who might be new to real estate investing? Sure thing, Daniel. Rental yield is essentially the annual return you get from your rental property, expressed as a percentage of the property's value. It's a key metric that helps investors gauge how profitable their investment might be. For example, if you own a property worth $200,000 and earn $10,000 in rent each year, your rental yield would be 5%. That makes sense. So, what factors influence these rental yields in Thailand? There are quite a few factors at play, but the big ones are location, property type, and market demand. Condos in Bangkok and Phuket often offer some of the highest yields due to the high demand for rentals in these areas. Villas, especially in tourist hotspots like Phuket and Koh Samui, can also provide strong rental income, particularly for short-term rentals. Speaking of condos, How do the yields in Bangkok compare to those in Phuket? In Bangkok, the average rental yield for condos is around 5% to 6%, which is quite solid. For example, a luxury condo at the Ritz-Carlton Residences could yield about 5.1% gross. Meanwhile, Phuket's condos offer similar returns, with yields typically ranging from 5% to 7%. The tourism factor really plays a big role here, boosting short-term rental income. And what about villas and houses? How do those stack up? Villas and houses can offer great returns, particularly in popular tourist areas. For example, a four-bedroom villa in Bang Tao, Phuket, might yield between 7% to 10% especially if it's located near the beach or in a gated community. These properties are highly sought after by both short-term tourists and long-term renters looking for a luxurious stay. Sounds like there's plenty of potential. But what about the risks, especially when it comes to undeveloped land? Great question, Daniel. Investing in undeveloped land can be very profitable, but it does come with its own set of challenges. The biggest risk is the uncertainty of future development. You might end up with land that doesn't appreciate or becomes difficult to sell. Plus, there are legal complexities and potential disputes, so it's crucial to do thorough research. Absolutely. And tourism, which we know is a big driver of rental yields, also plays a huge role in this equation, right? Yes, tourism is a major factor. Thailand's strong tourism industry drives demand for short-term rentals, especially in Phuket and Koh Samui. This influx of tourists allows property owners to charge premium rates during peak seasons, which can significantly enhance rental yields. That's great insight, Alice. Before we wrap up, let's quickly touch on some legal considerations for our foreign investors. Sure, Daniel. Foreign investors need to be aware that while they can own condos outright, land ownership is restricted. They can lease land long-term or invest through a Thai company. Plus, there are taxes and legalities that must be navigated carefully, so it's always best to consult with a legal expert familiar with Thai property laws. Thanks, Alice. To sum up, Thailand offers promising opportunities for property investors with its diverse market and attractive rental yields. Whether it's condos in bustling cities like Bangkok or luxury villas in tourist hotspots like Phuket, there's something for everyone. Absolutely. And for those of you looking to dive deeper into Thailand's real estate market, be sure to visit our website. We have a wealth of resources to help guide your investment journey. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. 
Don't forget to subscribe to the Ocean Worldwide Real Estate Podcast for more insights and updates on Thailand's real estate market. See you next time and happy investing. Thank you.